Listen, listen, wait, listen, bro, listen. This right here is the one and only LaMelo Ball himself, a.k.a. Mr. 92 points on your team, a.k.a. Mr. I'll run it himself. You listening, Mr. I'll run it. You listening? Mr. I'll run it himself, a.k.a. Mr. LaMelo LaFrance Ball himself. First things first, if you haven't already, make sure you like the video if you got drip. If you feel me, you feel me, like the video, you know what I'm saying? We about to get straight into it. This build right here, I'm telling y'all right now, this is a game-breaking build. This build is overpowered, bro. I'm telling y'all right now, this is that build. First thing first, once again, this build is based on your preference as well. So as I go throughout the video, you can adjust some things and all that. Ah, boom, right? Let's get right to it. First thing first, you know what I'm saying? Mr. I'll run it himself. He is right-handed. I'm gonna make him right. And his jersey number, if I'm not mistaken, he's going from number two to number one, but we're just gonna put him number two, number one. It don't matter, your preference, whatever you wanna put. We're gonna put number two. Matter of fact, we're gonna put number one. Mr. I'll run it, we all put him number one. Boom, right? Continue, you feel me? First things first, point guard. LaMelo Ball is a point guard. He's a tall point guard, don't get me wrong, but he, you know what I'm saying? He's a tall player, but he's a point guard. Let's be real right first thing first height six eight yes i know if you go on google it's gonna say lamella ball is six seven once again this is a 2k build trust me you gotta listen to me bro do you want to make mr i'll run it himself yes or no okay then come on right wait all the way down you know lamella ball you know what i'm saying i think he's like 180 but the lowest at six eight you can go 185 and once again at six seven at this build i'm telling y'all right now you do not get the attributes that you get on a 6-8 for some reason i don't know the reason but it's just like that in these in these games right next thing you want to do drop your wingspan to 6-11 yes 6-11 right then you want to hit continue feel me right first thing first close shots you want to put that all the way up to 60 only close shot you never really need close shot in 2k i'm telling you this right now unless you want to be one of them weird pole scorers that want to just post all game spin Hook shot old game. You could be an old head and do that. You could do that. You know what I'm saying? But this is LaMelo Ball. We're going to put a close shot 60. We're going to let that be there, right? Drive and layup. We're not going to put that too high. An 80 drive and layup should be good enough. You have a scooper on gold and a lot of other badges, silver, as far as your finishing badges. Next, drive and dunk. You want to put that all the way up to an 80. Yes, only an 80. Only 80. Once again, this is LaMelo Ball. And once again, if you want to adjust this build, you can get to it and really adjust this build. Next, standing up. Some people are going to be like, yo, why you put your standing up so high? Listen, once again, this is 2K24. You could, you can adjust this. Once again, standing dunk. this is something I address if you're watching the video. If you're listening, you can adjust this. You can put it down. I say don't put it, put it down below 45. But I'm going to put that at 60 post control. If you're a post scorer, you want to be one of them. Word, you can do that. If you're not touching post control. Next mid-range listen to me bro you have to listen to me you have to put your mid-range in 86 overall for the simple fact if you put an 86 mid-range you get open looks on gold because your three-pointer only maxes out to 85 and yes we'll be putting it at the 85 you drop it one time for your mid-range boom you lose open looks you want to have that gold and you get Hall of Fame comeback kid. If you're down on a lot of games, you know what I'm saying? Comeback kid can come in clutch. You know what I'm saying? To bring your team back. Boom, right? Next, free throw. Once again, if you play rec, it depends if you play rec or you play park. You don't have to really touch free throw. But on this build, you know what I'm saying? Once again, LaMelo Ball, he's not going to miss at the free throw line. You know what I'm saying? If you play rec, 80 free throws valid. Or your free throw, once again, is your preference. This is your build. This is literally your LaMelo Ball build, right? We all know LaMelo can pass. Like, let's be real. Pass accuracy, we got to put that up to an, a 91. For the simple fact, you put a 91, you get needle threaded gold. You get um Hall of Fame special delivery. Let's say you don't need that on this build. Once again, this this if you're listening, you can really go at 89 pass accuracy and still be good. And you can use those attributes to something else on this build. I promise you, you're going to be straight, right? Boom. Ball handle, you're going to put that at 85, you feel me? Spear ball, you're gonna put that a 79, right? 79 is more than enough for a 6'8, 185, 6'11 wingspan point guard. Trust me, bro. You gotta trust me on this one, bro. You got to, right? Interior defense. We know LaMelo's not really an interior 
defender like this, like that. You know what I'm saying? He's not really in the paint like that. But once again, this is 2K. If you play tools, whatever game mode you're playing, if you end up in the paint, you want to be able to get the stop in the paint. You know what I'm saying? You want to be able to do that. And once again, he's not the greatest defender neither. You know what I'm saying? Like his brother Lonzo, you know what I'm saying? The big bull brothers, you know what I'm saying, right? Perimeter defense, yes. You want to put that a 76. For the simple fact, when you put a 76, it's not popping up right now because I think you got to touch the the strength of the, the stamina. Yeah, you got to touch the stamina to get 94 feet. When you put a 76 perimeter defense, you get that level. Once again, you can adjust the defense how you really want to make this LaMelo Bowl build. But this is my preference of the LaMelo Bowl build. And this is what I mean. This is preference. Because in reality, what I'm about to do to the block, y'all going to be like, wow, look, right? Listen, block 68. You put a 68, you get bronze chase down on a LaMelo Bowl build. You know what I'm saying? Make that make sense. Not saying he can't block anything, but does he really have some LeBron chase artists? Does he, is he really chasing now, punching everything? You know what I'm saying? But bronze can work. Once again, you can adjust on how you want the block, on where you want it to be to for other attributes. Offensive rebound, you know, he gets boards, you know what I'm saying? He's going to lead that out of 50. Defensive rebound, you get rebound chaser on bronze at 60, literally at 60. Keep that there. Speed, you always want to max out your speed. Acceleration, you always want to max that out. Strength, once again, another one with preference. Boom. I'm putting in the 45 strength on this build just to get that clamps on bronze, just in case you're playing one of them cheese balls. You don't want to deal with that. Trust me. You got you got to trust me on this one. You got to. Right? Last but not least, you want to put your stamina max at 99. And there you go. You got it. The LaMelo Bowl build. 99 stamina. You know what I'm saying? 80 dunk. 85 3, 86 mid range with open looks on gold. Open looks literally works for every jump shot you shoot. Wide open. It literally works. It's literally going to pop up every single time. Once again, if you want to adjust the pass accuracy, look, I dropped this too. To, two to what you want to 89 you can put your driving dunk up and your vertical obviously go up with it but you don't got to do all that once again we're going to stick with this right here you know what i'm saying if you made it this far in the video drop the number 18 in the comments so i know you feel me you, you watch the video you feel me and if you feel me like the video too as well you know what i'm saying appreciate the love and support you know what i'm saying right boom x a if you're on playstation xbox it don't matter right and now you got the one and only literally the mellow ball finally we got a shade of a player in this video game finally a diamond a diamond perimeter threat he's a threat he's literally a threat i don't know if he's a school threat let me know if he's a school threat matter of fact he's a school threat he is six eight and literally can do damn near everything he's a school threat like come on let's be real lonzo ball the mellow ball andrew holiday come on bro you got a defensive do two you got two playmakers. Drew, Drew Holiday's a playmaker too on top of that. And Lonzo and Drew Holiday, they definitely do play defense. Once again, this is the final product of this build. You feel me? You got LaMelo Ball build. This is basically, LaMelo, it's the brother build right here. This is Lonzo LaMelo. But obviously, I feel like more LaMelo, you know what I'm saying? Right? Yo, I feel like LaMelo Ball going to go crazy this season. Let me know what y'all think. Same thing with Lonzo. Hopefully, if Lonzo can come back. Same thing if LaMelo, if he stay healthy. You know what I'm saying? They can go crazy. Right? Once again, this is LaMelo Ball Build. If you haven't already, if you feel me, if you got drip, like the video. Make sure you like, share, subscribe if you're new. You know what I'm saying? And if you mess with this with this video, yo, hit that post notification. Ah! The stutter, my bad. Hit that post notification bell button too. You know what I'm saying? We drop a lot of build videos over here at Type Ish. You feel me? Right? Once again, if you feel me, drop a like. You know what I'm saying? And I'm out, bro.